Hello once again to Star Wars The Old Republic and we are making our way to the super weapon compound with the intention of resolving this problem that we have on Iocath. Uh, not quite sure how we're meant to get to this place. I guess we have to go up here. Is this right? It seems to be right. So we'll take that as as it. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, just a refresher for myself as much as anything else. Uh, yeah, there's the super weapon that um, the Sith Empress, may she rest in peace, uh, activated is now having a build up of energy. Uh, which is not good for us uh, because it will probably mean that we end up being rather dead. So let's try and resolve that uh, before we end up, well, rather like the Empress, in fact. Okay, so cutscene. And look, we've explored all of Iocath. That's good. I've reached the super weapon facility. How do I shut it down? You need to interface with the main controls. Look for a throne, take a seat, then hope for the best. Am I crazy, or is this the third one I've seen today? Yeah, they definitely seem to have a thing with thrones. The eternal throne, the thrones to activate the weapons. Somebody's got a complex. Ah, hell. No, not Valkorion. No, not Valkorion. Although it does look awfully like... Where am I? That's a cool night. Who are you? I am Rage, Molten Fury, your god, and your destroyer. Yeah, nah, mate. All right, Mr. Rage. Can you drop the act and point me in the direction of the super weapon? <laughs> the Sith bow to no one. Show me your rage. Calm, peace. It denies fury. A sacrifice mediocre. Mediocre. I didn't come here to be poked and prodded. Mate, that thing's gonna love my Sith. You were lured here. Blinded by duty. Distracted Hello. by trust. You did not see the blade to your neck. The what? rage in your shadow. The traitor. I've given up everything to help the galaxy rebuild. Who would try to destroy me? One, mark my anger, pain, hope eroding. The betrayer lured you to Iotaf, igniting war, spark the engines of rage, envy, passion, hate, sorrow. The betrayer hey. now offers you sacrifice pride, fuel for the six gods. What do you mean by sacrifice? I really don't like the sound of this. If it's Lana, I'm going to be well pissed. Uh, that's not good. Ships of the Eternal Fleet, open fire. Ah! 
Well, that didn't go well. I want to know who this traitor is. That's like the only thing I want to know right now. Lana? Don't worry, Commander. You're safe. I found the super weapon. It was a giant droid. I know. You've been talking in your sleep. I almost had to stuff a sock in your mouth. Whatever that droid is, you knocked it out of commission with the Eternal Fleet. Now it's recharging and gearing up for a counterattack. Which is why we must strike soon. Hesitate too long and the Titan may destroy us all. Someone betrayed me. They lured me into that death trap and sabotaged the throne. Just like they tricked all of us into fighting a war on Iocath. The conspiracy cuts deeper than we imagined. Sounds like an inside job, all right. Only a handful of people could get close enough to sabotage the throne. Who could have done such a thing? So, do I have to accuse someone? Oh, man. It could be any... Like... I actually d think it's either going to be Lana or Theron. I don't think it's Malcolm. Because I don't think he'd have the access. And that person sure as hell didn't have his frame. Ah, uh, I, I, I don't know. I think it's Lana. You're my spy master, Lana. No one's better positioned to stick a blade between my ribs. I thought you trusted me, Commander. I see I was wrong. If Lon is under suspicion, you better add me to the lineup. I am the better spy, after all. How kind of you, Theron. Then there's Malcolm, Ego, Visla, Satil, the entire Alliance army. Whoever it is, I want them rooted out. Quickly. There's only one solution. You must monitor everyone. Hold on, Minister of Paranoia. You can't invade everyone's privacy to sniff out a single rat. I can't, but the Commander can. Give the order and I'll begin surveillance of everyone. Even Theron and myself. It's the only way to flush out the traitor. Hmm... I'm going to play this suspiciously. I can't take any more chances. If someone so much as scratches their nose, I want to hear about it. We'll form a surveillance. Wow, 150 team. dark side points. A suspect. Jesus. Commander, I knew you'd pull through and back in fighting shape no less. I hope you're ready to return to the front lines. Their Empress is dead. Are the Imperials really refusing to surrender? Afraid so. The I'm not going to accuse him just yet. To the teeth. Now that Asina's gone, they're more desperate than ever for control of Iocath. They're still desperate to claim the superweapon. If we take it first, they'll have no choice but to surrender. Then that's where we set our sights. But we can't stop there. We need to keep hammering the Empire. Day by day, hour by hour, only then will we win this war. Now, if you'll excuse me, the battlefield's calling my name. I'll see you on the front lines. We'll track his movements, see what he's hiding. I'll promise you right now, whoever this traitor is, we will find them. And we'll make them pay. I know you will. While you start searching, I'm going to win the war they started. For the Eternal Alliance. I'm br I've, uh... May the Force serve us all. I just want to know who this person is. It's going to bug the hell out of me. So, uh, we're not quite as pure of heart as we were. <laughs> Oops. Uh... So, 
Uh, what is our next port of call? Okay, so we need to assign some troops. Ah, I remember seeing this console earlier on. A few episodes back. I don't know what this... So we get to assign our troops somehow. But I don't know what that means. So, your forces are ready for deployment. Will you support the Galactic Republic or the Sith Empire? Well, I'm not going to support the bloody Sith, am I? Considering we're meant to be fighting them. Fine. Like... I guess, like, I know that you're going to have Sith characters that will, or even Republic characters that might support the Sith Empire, but... Can they not just look at my decision and just be like allocating troops for the side that you went with? Just seems to make the most sense to me. There we go. Right. So, where are we going? Okay, it's not too far. So, we're now heading towards the mission board. Is that going to be... Like, bounties and stuff? Destroy 25 Iocath droids. Okay, so this seems like it's going to be... A load of... Grindy missions. Let's see where we're actually meant to be going. Uh, pretty much anywhere. I uh, don't know where the best place to find Iocath droids is, but I guess we gotta go. Um, I'm wondering, like, is this even worth filming? Are we at the end of the sort of the story. But we'll see. If it's going to send me off. We'll do the 25. And then if it ends up sending me on you know another fool's errand of go and kill 30 Sith like troopers or something. You know. I'll know that it's just going to be a load of annoying fetch quests. Why does my companions keep disappearing? Let's take Lana with us. I'm ready. See if we can get her to like us. I'm amazed we didn't die fighting those three things, actually. I'm vaguely impressed. Uh, uh, what's attacking me? Wow, that's good, isn't it? Uh... Yeah, well, that's great, isn't it? Okay, let's uh, destroy these things then, considering the other one is incognito. Hey, look, we're an eight. We're a fifth of the way there. Okay, so that guy's still stuck in a wall. I say we ignore him. I like that dude's ride. That is cool. I want it. Okay, so. Hopefully, by running this way, Lana will end up just following me at some point. Thank you. Okay, so let's destroy this thing. 
I don't know where the best place to fight. At least, like, the droids and stuff are actually fairly easy to come across. They're not hidden. Which is good. That would have been very tedious. Where that leads to. Be handy. I need to have like a list of like conversation options for when these uh, grindy bits rear their heads. Like a point, like a game of 20 questions. Although, actually, that would probably be quite a bad option because you really need two people for 20 questions. But, you know, a crib sheet of shit to talk about would not be a bad idea. I'll add it to my to do list. Uh, I'm still undecided as to what I'm going to do Mass Effect wise. I'm going to probably give Andromeda another go just to see if I can get the thing not running like a piece of shit. Uh, that's the aim, anyway. Uh, let's probably pick that stuff up. Um, but yeah, uh, Mass Effect. Not sure what I'm doing. Okay, what happened there? That was weird. Yeah, I really... I did a jump, I didn't jump, and then they died. Bit weird. Um, but yeah. Like, do people... Are people that invested in Mass Effect Andromeda? I wish I knew... Like, what... I wish I knew what I wanted to do. Vis a vis Andromeda. But I don't. Part of me is just tempted to just scrap it and just be like, yeah, it. Ambitious but rubbish. Uh, and move on to something else. I am a bit bioware out, it must be said. Um, I'm thinking maybe something like Doom might not be a bad option. I've played like six hours of it um, and I love it it's great but I still haven't got round to finishing it yet which isn't a fair a, a, anything that reflects on the game the game's cracking but I just kind of haven't got round to finishing it uh, which says more about me than it does the game I think uh, I really need to, because it was really good. Uh, but, yeah, just something about it just stopped. I do this a lot. Although apparently not with Mass Effect games, up until very recently. Okay, so, the actual next part of these things is to interact with things. Alright. I don't know what that... I don't know if that means, like... Uh, well, let's get back on the scooter thing. And let's just... Whee! So, uh, let's head back to the Republic area. Uh... I'm wondering if this interacting stuff is to do with spying on people? Which would make sense, considering that is what we were talking about. Okay, we could have just... Mouse droid control station. Controller mouse droid. 
Uh, what? Should feel better now. Okay, I don't actually want to do that, but it doesn't seem to mind that I don't want to do that. Okay, so the next thing to do, apparently. Uh, let's head down here. What's this one? Oh, it's just a access walker something or others. Walker access terminal. So I'm guessing these like little shard things that we've been picking up do actually have a purpose. Which is apparently this. But I don't know what that does. I'm guessing it's some kind of side quest. Some little missions that you can do that give you stuff. I mean, the costs are quite high. I'm not especially fussed about trying it out as of yet until I actually know what it is. Uh, for a start, I don't even know if I've got that many... Yeah, I don't have that many, like, power shards, so... I'm not going to do that. <laughs> Mounted turret manufacturing. Yeah, see, I don't have the resources that it wants me to have in order to be able to do these things, so... A mixed blessing, because I really don't want to do them, but I also can't do them, so... Yay? And then the last one is interact with P3R1. Who I'm guessing is a droid rather than a side quest thing. Nope. P3R1. Oh, there we go. Okay, I don't want to do any of that. Scion Aramis. Okay. Hopefully this will get on with the story. That's rather fetching. Um, right, Alliance Camp. We can at least get the uh, bike out, if nothing else. Right, okay, so. He's up this bit. Okay, so there's a story in an instant, so that's good. I like their armor. I want to be able to get that. I really like that. Please tell me that's available. I have to check uh, TOR fashion. It looks so cool, and but in fact, I think it is. Outlander, the tapestry of fate joins us once more. We are all that remains of the Scions of Zakul. We have come to aid your quest, just as the prophecy foretold. I've already toppled the Eternal Empire and taken the throne. What more can you help me with? You still face your greatest challenge. The God of Rage. You're talking about the giant droid. The super weapon. Yeah, we killed him, didn't we? What you call a super weapon, we know as one of the six gods. They were forged on Iocath in a forgotten age. Their masters set them loose upon Zakul, killing millions, and giving birth to our pantheon of gods. Now Tithe has reawakened, and his brethren will soon join him to destroy us all. There must be a way to defeat Tithe, and stop the others from waking up. They cannot be stopped, but they can be tamed. Your fate is already written. You will clash with the gods. And when you subdue them, you will be judged worthy to take possession of their shells. 
You will drive the Titans against your Imperial foes and become a god yourself. Um, I'm... I didn't particularly want to be a bloody emperor. I sure as hell don't want to be a god. Did you see all this in one of your prophecies? Only glimpses. You are destined to confront the gods. Beyond that, your fate remains unseen. Perhaps you will impress the god of rage and assume his mantle to march against the Empire. Rage isn't very Jedi-like. Read from history. I will contact you if we see more. But for now, your ultimate fate is clouded in darkness. Joy, oh joy. Okay, so. Uh, so there is an operation that you have to do. Enter the Iocath operation. I do not like doing operations. Uh, story mode operations. I'm hoping this has a story mode. Um, in fact, I don't even know if... Because I know that the flashpoints have a solo mode. But I don't think the operations do. I am just going to go and check. I'm just going to go and see what actually it says over there. But I've got a horrible suspicion the operations are a multiplayer thing. And, yeah, Imperial Forward Base. Yeah, it doesn't seem to let me. Uh, so, I'm guessing we're going to end the episode there until I can figure out how the bloody hell I'm meant to proceed with the next part of this story. Because, yeah, operations. Not my strong point, it must be said. Um, let's just double check to see it's not because I was on a bloody speed or anything. No, it's not. Okay, so, a slightly abrupt end to the episode there. Certainly more abrupt than I had intended. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to do a little bit of research on that. There might be ways of doing it. I think you can go into Group Finder. Um... And, yeah, facing the machines of war. Yeah, this is the final bit, so you have to go after the god of rage. Okay, uh, let's see if... What's this? Machines of war. It's just I just want to double check, just to make sure that there isn't anything that I'm... Stupidly missing out on. Um, but yeah. I sh I, I'll figure that out myself. Um, but yeah, hopefully see you in the next episode. Uh, if I... That guy looked like Iron Man. Um, yeah. So, <laughs> hopefully see you in the next episode. There should be a next episode if I can figure this shit out. Um, and yeah, we'll go from there. So... I uh, hope you've enjoyed that. If you have, like the video, comment below, and subscribe if you want to see more. And if you want to follow me on Twitter, it's at Jason... At, bleh, no, it's not. It's at Jace Curtis. That's the first time I fucked that up. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully, I will see you next time.